Wildcats. Good morning, Wildcats. Good morning, Wildcats. I'm Desiree. I'm Ashley. I'm Mitchell. I'm Ethan. I'm Jordan. I'm Scrooge McDuck, but you can call me Devin. I'm my own replacement, but you can call me Josh. And I'm blind. We can call me Josh. And I'm the boy who lived. We can call me Josh. And I'm Hyrule's final last hope. I mean, uh, Jim, Jim, whatever, you can call me Josh. And I'm Forgetful Frank, and sometimes I have trouble finishing mine, but you can call me Josh. And I like posting my prom nails on Snapchat. We can call me Josh. I'm the epitome of these announcements. We can call me Josh. Uh, and I'm sleep deprived from this three week testing schedule. We can call me Josh. And I quit! Making jokes for these announcements, but you can call me Josh. You really think that you're the highlight of these announcements? And you really think people watch for you? The fame is really getting to him. Anyways, so who did your nails for prom because they are hideous? Uh, you. Oh. Well, anyways. Now, here's my chance to go back to sleep as we go to Devin with a weather update. Say, Josh, I hear you got yourself some new kicks. I sure did, bro. Those are nice and all, but what if I told you that someone here can design you some shoes that will blow your mind? Good morning, Wildcats. I'm Ethan. And I'm Jerry. Y'all are expecting the morning show? Well, guess what? Now it's a Josh and Ashley show. All right, what's on the agenda for this week? I've heard that this week we've got Spirit Week. Huh. Well, a good time for prom. Hey, Josh, what's the best way to spend your Valentine's weekend? Sitting at home in my underwear, eating chicken nuggets, watching Stranger Things. How was your four-day weekend, Josh? Lots of sleep, but also lack of sleep. If I had myself a job, I'd be some kind of insomniac or whatever. So are we going to ignore the fact that you're wearing a horribly made bee costume? Hey, I heard folks in Rotary Theater Troop accomplish a lot at last week's Destiny and Regional Competition. So why is there Sharpie on your forehead? Because tonight is Media Club's movie night, where we will be showing... Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone. Tickets are $5, and the movie starts at 7 p.m. Food and drinks will be provided. Also, is that going to wash off? Ten minutes of soapy water says otherwise. You may catch one of your fellow media club members dressing up as, oh, I don't know, Dread Pirate Roberts? Is that why you were dressed as a bee yesterday because of last week's bee movie night? I have no idea what you're talking about, but I do know that academic tutoring is tomorrow from 7.30 to 11.30 a.m. Are you going to be awake for the rest of the announcements? Yeah, <laughs> something like that. I just want to get through this week. Now, how's it looking outside today? Well, we're going to have a high of 83 and a low of 53. Basically, if you wear a jacket, then you're, you lost your mind. <laughs> now, let's go on to sports. I don't think so, pal. Get out of oh, here, Jocko Taco. Uh, How you doing, Wildcats? I'm Gabe. What it do, Wildcats? I'm Gabe. How's it going, guys? My name is Sports. And welcome to the Lies and Gabe Show. It's your boy, Devin here. And Jay with your sports announcements. Softball triads on February 6th, 7th, and 8th. Today, there will be a boys basketball game versus Centennial at Centennial at 4 p.m. Now for a quick commercial break. So I guess that Sharpie from Friday didn't wash off. Yeah, sadly. Hey, guys, guess what? It's Wednesday, my dudes. <laughs> now let's get your weather update. It's getting very sunny now because it looks like spring is here. So be happy for it's that. It's looking beautiful. Thank you, Jared and Elias, for that sports update. <laughs> yes, I would love to work with you, Mr. Quentin Tarantino. Uh, oh, are we live again? Um, yes. Oh, uh, yeah, Willow Club rundown, whatever. Now let's kick into the Willow Club rundown. Time to slide into those DMs. I mean the Willow Club rundown. Now let's... Fly into the Willow Club Rundown. Now a swish and flick off to a weather update. Now let's fly into the Willow Club Rundown, and I totally didn't steal that from Devin. Now let's go to Jacob with a- Hey, 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 hey. I do the transition to weather. I always get the last word. You know this. You are so pathetic. Yes, I am. Wait, wait a sec. You actually transition to weather. I'm going to let you take the spotlight this time. Oh, okay. <clears throat> now... And I'll take the spotlight right back and shine it right onto weather. What's poppin' Wildcats? I'm tired, but I'm gonna give you your weather. Now let's go on a World Club Rundown. Um, well, you already know the update, so there you go. I'm Desiree. And I'm the worst anchor to ever step on the show, but you can call me Devin. Don't worry, Devin, you are definitely a better anchor than Josh. I think he's gonna be triggered when he gets back, but who cares? I am not the worst anchor at this school, Desiree. But you can call me Josh. So I'm guessing you saw the announcements with me and Devin? Mm-hmm, yep. And you heard what I said? Ah, yes, I did. Well, it's true. Now let's get off to our worst anchor with the weather. Hey there, Wildcats. I'm Devin. Uh, I got tossed off by the world's saltiest anchor. Hey, Josh, man, I'll bury the hatchet if you're willing to, but if you want a war, I'll give you one. Our shout out of the day comes from Mitchell saying, I'm the best anchor there ever was, ever. I feel like I have a challenge. Have, have a great, great day, day Wildcats. Wildcats.